over the river and through Dubuque to get along we go. I just called Wilson in Sioux City. Just a little bit more. Well, hold on, hold on. It's about 14 and three quarters. Ladies and gentlemen, we solved the rough riding problem. Hey everybody, it's Ryan. Welcome back to How Farms Work. Today is Big Red's big day. As you can see, we got Big Red backed up underneath the souk up bin. We're gonna start unloading corn into Big Red. And we're gonna start hauling corn down to Gavilon Grain in Dubuque. So we're gonna go ahead and just load it up, take it down there. Hopefully things go pretty smooth, we'll fi find out. I'm feeling pretty confident considering about the amount of road time that I've got with the truck and with all of the work that we put into it as well, I'm not really all that worried about it. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and load the truck up and head on down to Dubuque. Hey Calvin. Just got to Gavilon and Dubuque. It was a pretty easy going trip. Scales weren't open. And uh, it just weighed us and our weight was 79,520, which we can haul 80,000. So it's pretty close. So they just had to take a sample so they know what moisture and if there's any foreign matter, uh, things like that or what they test for. So we're gonna pull around Gavilon and dump.
that's all we got out for today. We just finished filling Big Red for the morning. So let's climb up inside the bin and see what it looks like. So now you're looking at the inside of the bin. Now in situations like this, where we have started unloading, we will never climb in to check the moisture or anything. It's one of those golden rules of farming. Never climb in a bin that has had corn or any kind of product unloaded from it uh, at any point in time since it's been filled. But still a lot of corn in here yet. So far Big Red has been handling pretty well. Um, she is a little bit sluggish going up the hillsides but with a 10 speed that's kind of expected uh, since you don't have as many gears to play with. But Travis in the meantime while I've been hauling corn has been working on the planter. He's been changing the chains on it so that's going to be ready to go before long and uh, planning is coming up here fairly shortly depending on what the weather does. Uh, we're thinking later this month is going to be when we're going to be able to start, but we'll just have to see what Mother Nature does. I guess that winter is not a style. It's going to be making a comeback here before long. So uh, it should be about it for this video. I'm going to be hauling with Big Red for quite a while. It's been going to be keeping me busy. So. With that, I'll let you all go. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Be sure to check out all of our other ones. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat, all how farms work. And with that, see you next time. <laughs>